Hello guys, welcome to my channel of Plus Serenity. Hope you guys are doing well and doing fine too. So welcome to another brand new episode of me talking about your drama that is a bit dramatic this time. Well, that dramatic must add flavor to the drama to make it interesting and worth watching. So it's okay to call that a bit drama, right? So on this note, let's get started. Today, I'm going to talk about a drama that is a Thailand drama. It was released in 2017, having 15 episodes named Clue and Shade. It has Martin Suparat and Odessa Spearband as male and female leads. This drama is a revenge story where it starts off with revenge and hate and then ends up with love. In this drama, Mart is a lawyer and Odessa is a very top model and an actress. Odessa's mom marries a very rich and wealthy businessman who does many illegal activities to earn money. He even kills people, to does drugs and stuff. He has a lustful eyes for Odessa. So in order to fulfill his lustful desires, he drugs Odessa's boyfriend so that he can rape her and enjoy. But as God is there everywhere, she doesn't lose her senses completely and before she could lose her senses, she drives off from there with a very high speed. She then accidentally hits of a girl who ends up dead in the hospital because she was inebriated and she was not in her full senses. Unfortunately, that girl who was died turns out to be Mark Prince's fiancé whom he loved since childhood. So he plans to revenge on Odessa because she killed uh, his girlfriend and uh, fiancé and uh, shattered all his dreams of having a happy life with his fiancé. But a hurdle on this happens when Odessa's stepfather and mother uses their money and influence to cover up the case because uh, they could not let uh, his bad deeds come out so that uh, he would not go to jail and his mother would not be penniless. Then Mark decides that he would always go behind Odessa, stalk her, do something good or bad by hook or crook. He would definitely make her confess that she was the one who made the accident because she was drunk. And he also thinks that she is a sad actress because of some situation that had happened. But as times pass by, he starts to see that she is not a sad actress, she is a very kind woman. And um, he starts to understand her and he falls in love with her. But will he ever confess to her that he loves her or will he think that he could not allow himself to fall in love with her because she is the sinner and he would become a sinner because she killed his ex-girlfriend and uh, fiancé and if he loves her it would be a sin because he is going to love and marry a girl who killed his first girlfriend and fiancé or will he ever get to know that that day she was not drunk and killed his girlfriend but it was because she was inebriated and she was running from there to safeguard herself from her own stepfather what will happen this from the crux of the story as i already told you this story ends up with love so obviously it is a happy ending but to reach to that happy ending lots of things happen in the drama uh, many heart rendering things happen lots of tears plans plottings and all happen but eventually they end up together with lots of things going on and all these things definitely make the drama worth watching so this marks the end of the story and hope you liked listening to the drama and uh, if you already watched it then it's well and good if you haven't watched it you can watch it it is available in youtube and uh, thanks for your love and support and if you have any drama recommendations or any kind of video making suggestions please drop them in the comment box below i would love to read them and make videos on them and uh, have a good day or night bye bye take care